good day. You are welcome to our reflection for today. I'm Dr. Prosper Tetedo, Elder Prosper Tetedo in the United Kingdom. Our topic for reflection is keep your goals in focus. And our key scriptures are Psalm 112 verse 8, Hebrew chapter 10 verses 35 to 36, and Philippians chapter 3 verses 13 to 14. Dear Christian friend, don't lose sight of your goals. His heart is established. He will not be afraid. Psalm 1, 1, 2, verse 8. To achieve success in life, there are three obstacles you have to be aware of and overcome. One, weariness. Race horses run at approximately the same speed. Sometimes the difference between winning and losing the race comes down to their heart to win. So look into your heart today and see if you are truly committed. Do not cast away your conf confidence, which has great reward, for you have need of endurance so that after you have done the will of God, you may receive the promise. Hebrews chapter 10, verses 35 to 36. Two, fear. When it comes to commitment, there are four kinds of people. The first are cop-outs. These are people who have no goals and who don't commit. The second are holdouts. These are people who don't know if they can reach their goals, so they are afraid to commit. The third are dropouts. These are people who start toward a goal, but give up when the going gets tough. And the fourth are all outs. People who set goals, commit to them and pay the price to reach them. Which one of the four are you? This is a personal question. Fear and faith will always be present in your life. And the one you choose will determine whether you succeed or fail. The third is complacency. Successful businessman Ray Kroc said, as long as you are green, you are growing. As soon as you are ripe, you start to rot. Unquote. If you are wise, you will take regular rest periods to refresh, renew, and refocus. But you must not settle for yesterday's successes or coast on today's momentum. Be like Paul. I focus on this one thing, forgetting the past and looking forward to what lies ahead. I press on to reach the end of the race. Philippians chapter 3, verses 13 to 14. May the Lord help us to focus on our goals and not to stop at yesterday's success for our tomorrow shall be greater than today and there are greater highs even to attain. God bless you and be a blessing.